<sighs> so yeah, imagine, man just realized that I had something in my eye, like, I, well not in my eye, but on my, like, over there, whatever you call it, innit? But anyways, if you haven't realized, I'm standing on a chair, so that's why, like, the wall might look like it's a bit up, you know what I'm saying? Man, standing on a chair, don't ask. Um, this is today's drink of choice, Magnum. Original Jamaican recipe. But I heard there was like a... Wait, hold on. Why does it look like there's something stuck over it? Like, there is something stuck over it, innit? That is mad. But um, what was I going to say? There was something in the news about Magnum and it like being fake or something like that. Like, if there's no... If there's no number on the bottom, it's fake or something. I don't know. Hold on. Let me let me Google this for a second. Hold on. A bit of research here. Yeah. And apparently on the internet, people were saying that Magnum that doesn't have a number, like doesn't have numbers on the bottom is fake. But I just went to like the actual, Ray, well, I saw like a news article from Ray and Nephews who makes Magnums. And they said they make two different type of bottles and one bottle has numbers on the bottom and one bottle doesn't. And they said that there is no fake Magnum in circulation. So that means nobody has tried to make fake Magnum. So boom, we're going to we're gonna run this one here. All right, so boom. I just did a bit of research on Magnum and you know what I'm saying, what it's for. It's wine, okay? So it's not like, I don't know, but yes, yeah, wine. I don't really know much about alcohol. So it says that it is used for energy and sexual stimulus. I don't even know, but some next words in it. But basically, it's used to push your sex drive. I think that's what they meant by it, in it. So basically, man's supposed to drink this and just be on it. You get it. So obviously, I do three tests when it comes to the drink. Yeah, the smell test, the taste test, and. How does it make you feel test? Because obviously this is, you know what I'm saying? Man's supposed to be on it after drinking it. I'm going to drink as much as I can. And then I'm going to wait a few hours and then I'm going to see if like, you know what I'm saying? Man's ready to go. So, without further ado. Quite easy to open. Okay, let's the smell test. It smells nice. <clears throat> Sorry. It smells nice. It smells like. It smells like. It smells like medicine, but sweet medicine, if that makes sense. Like, it smells like cough syrup, but sweet cough syrup. I don't know, but it smells sweet. It smells sweet still. So, out of 10, I'd give the smell. I'm gonna give this a seven. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna give this one a seven still, because it smells like juice. Like it smells like you know what I'm saying. It smells like something that man would want to drink. Seven out of ten for the Magnum. Okay, cool. So now the taste test. The taste test. Cool. Um, it tastes like I still have It tastes like alcohol Now For people that have never Drank alcohol You know you must have Some sort of feeling What alcohol would taste like This tastes like alcohol Like I don't know what other way To put it You still get the aftertaste So I can I can taste like a little bit of Not a burning sensation In my throat <laughs> No homo. Not a burning sensation in my throat, but I can taste it in my throat. Like, it's still there. Like, it's lingering. It's trying to hold on to man's throat. Do you feel me? Okay, cool. I'm going to try to drink as much as possible to get the magnum feeling. Defo tastes like... Um, Defo tastes like medicine. Like, when you're just drinking it, it tastes like cold medicine. Obviously, it was in the fridge. So it tastes like cold medicine. Uh, I hate alcohol, man. I'm just trying to drink it. Still getting that strong. Now it don't really taste like... It's, I don't know, man. It just tastes... 
It just tastes like it's alcohol. But I don't know how else to put it. rank blood this is rank i'm just trying to finish it so i can get you know what i'm saying so i can tell you lot if man gets any type of feeling oh shit man got no i'm joking man ain't got no feeling yet bro that'd be so fake Uh, man, that was butters. But there you go. The Magnum is done. The Magnum is done. Right now, I'm feeling, I'm feeling the like the tingly sensation. Not a tingle, tingle, but like a burny tingle. Like it's not burning, but it wants to burn. Do you get it? So yeah, that's what man's feeling in my throat. In my belly, it's just feeling like I just backed a little, you know what I'm saying? I backed a drink in it. Oh no, shit, my belly. Belly's starting to, I can feel the burning sensation in my belly. Yeah. I can feel the burning sensation in my belly still. Maybe I drank it too quick. Other than that, out of 10, what I would give the taste, it ta I'd give it a five. I'd give it a five, honestly. You know what? It smells better than it tastes. It hundred percent smells better than it tastes. So yeah. I'm trying to wait to see if I feel like I wanna be stood up. Like obviously man was just sitting down there from I just stood up and I'm feeling waved, bro. Man's actually feeling waved. Yo. The Magnum has actually got me moving mad. <laughs> Man, what the fuck? Hey, yo, pattern up, selfie. Hey, yo, pattern up. A Magnum, you know. Moving mad, fam. But how does it make me feel? At, that, at the time, it didn't make me feel no way. And right now... It don't make me. It didn't make me feel no way. Like I just feel like, I, you know, what I'm saying I just drank a bottle of Magnum. That's it. But um, yeah, man. So, would I recommend it to you lot? Not really. Not really. Unless you're a drinker. If you're a drinker, then yeah, maybe I might recommend it. It might make you feel a bit sweet. You feel me? But if you're not a drinker like me, I wouldn't recommend it at all. So yeah, man. That's. On to the next drink, fam. On to the next drink. <laughs>